The Minister of State for Education, Dr. Yusuf Sanunu, has said the federal government will set up a formal negotiation team between the Parent Teacher Association and all the relevant stakeholders to meet on the recent increase in tuition fees for schools across the country. Speaking at a news conference in commemoration of the International Day to Protect Education from Attack in Abuja, the minister said the hike in school fees could be the major cause of various attacks attacks happening across schools. He added that there was a need to find a solution to the problem. Sununu also said that the federal government had ratified the Safe School Declaration in December 2019 and developed a safe school policy to uphold the right to education in emergency situations. As part of efforts to reduce out-of-school children in Emo State, the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints have, has revamped the dilapidated Umwazu Primary School in Ungogbala area of Emo State. The primary school, which has been abandoned over the years, with students studying under a tree, was reconstructed by the charity arm of the church to allow the children learn in a conducive environment to encourage school enrollment. Speaking during the commissioning of the school, leaders of the community commended the faith-based organization for remembering them, noting that it is the gospel of Christ. In his speech, the representative of the church, Kelechi Obiora, says the gesture is aimed at spreading love of Jesus Christ and encouraging school enrollment in the rural areas. The school became dilapidated in the year 2008. A boundary school, which would have had the attention of the state government and local government at large, was neglected by various regimes of government, and this caused many parents to move their, their children to the private schools. This school has witnessed tremendous setback because of the total dilapidation, thereby, thereby caused many, many, many children dropping out of school due to high rate of school fees in the private sector. This is a time you will guide your something, jealousy. Guide this school, jealousy. Because they will get a bed at hand What millions in there. Today is a day this community Amala will never forget. Because we have never, I said never, experienced this kind of life in this community. And I can say that it's God's duty. I also want to thank the ministry people, more especially the chairman, Dwight Bishop Uzo, who have been working restlessly to put today a materialization. I want to say and promise our guests that this school, we are going to handle it the way it's supposed to be handled. The grace of God has helped put up this primary school uh, classroom blocks. And um, I want to use this medium to thank uh, the community for allowing us this opportunity to bring up this uh, school Yes, to this standard back. We hope if the Lord give us the power, we would like to do more. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.